Forgive me. I thought you were one of them. That statue was one of Master Ezel's. It wasn't enough for the Mongols to kill my father. They had to desecrate his legacy. Your Master Ezel's son. I'm sorry to hear he's gone. We won't see his like again. This statue was his best. I could restore it if I had his tools. But his killers have taken our home, too. I'll get the tools. And we'll honor your father's memory by restoring his work. Thank you, my lord. Our home is just up the mountain road. And if you can avenge him... I will. Someone's using the Master's tools. Master Izo is alive. What do you want? Master Izo, I'm glad you're alive. Your son thinks the Mongols killed you. <sighs> Poor boy. I'll take you to him. No. The reason I'm alive is because a Mongol general admires my work. The Mongols are mutilating your sculptures. Destroying your legacy. He wants me to create a masterpiece for Kublai Khan himself. I can't refuse. Gather your tools. We're leaving. Which of my statues is damaged? The Bosatsu down the road. I created that to honor my son's birth. It's not my finest work. He disagrees. Mamoru is a good son. But his eye for art has always been lacking. How could you think that creating a statue for Kublai Khan is more important than your family, or your own people? Family and nations wither and die, with the tender curl of Kanon's fingers, the fierce stance of a stone warrior in mid-strike. They are eternal. You can have both your family and your art. A samurai cannot serve two lords. It's the same for an artist. That's a sad way to look at the world. The world is a sad place. I love my son. But I serve my art. This way.
Don't make a sound. Come sound. here and fight! Quiet. Defending your legacy. I destroyed all to have him back. All you can do is honor his memory. Be the man he thought you were. I'm sorry, my son. <laughs> 